is back home tonight after working with an organization helping orphans escape Ukraine. The country has an estimated 100,000 orphans, and that number is expected to rise as so many flee the country unaccompanied. And as new special Ashley Moser explains, what she saw during this trip was both heartbreaking and inspiring. Well, Mike and Deanie, Mary Crafts was there for seven days with Utah-based organization Exodus. Their goal was to get those orphans out of the country. Many of them are special needs and need medical care. She says this experience was life-changing, and it made her realize that even the worst in humanity can bring out the best in people. To see them gather around and instantly know what to do, how to do triage, how to get them, you know, located into one of the safe houses. Mary Craft says it was inspiring to work alongside nearly a dozen volunteers, nurses, EMTs, who helped around 50 orphans escape Ukraine. We were rescuing those orphans that you've seen in the photos, and they all needed IVs. Many of them needed the nose tubes. Uh, they are not verbal. They can't tell you what they need. She said many of them are special needs and required medical care. The nonprofit using an ambulance to bust them out. Some were even abandoned. The caretakers in these orphanages have just walked away and, and ran as refugees. In the face of war, Mary says she saw hope. Many locals in Romania took the group in. They were opening up their homes, not only to receive the refugees, but of people like us who were volunteering there. At the refugee camps, she helped organize donations for many families streaming into surrounding countries. She recalls keeping a woman's kids occupied as the mother dealt with her new reality. Take a big sigh, look down, smile at her children, wrap her arms around them, turn, and walk to what they didn't know. UNICEF reporting from February 24th to March 17th, 500 children fled to Romania unaccompanied. It's something Mary saw firsthand, an experience she'll never forget as she watched her team care for so many of them. You can see that in the video, so loving to get to the one. Uh, uh, I'm changed forever for sure. Now, Mary does plan to go back in the next month with that organization, Exodus. This time, she'll be focusing on getting many of those women and children visas to help them get to their next country to start their new lives. Back to you. You know, it's just inspiring, Ashley, when we can hear how Utahns are making a difference night after night. Thanks. Right.